Welcome to my store. This is just all this rocks and stuff that I took here. Just you can see bristle worm, bristle worm, bristle worm. There's a couple more bristle worms in there. And there's a few in here too. And there's some crabs that uh, have come out of the rocks now that they're sitting on the table. Oh yeah. There's an emerald crab. Little baby. Cool. Oh. What? Uh, is that something? And there's a little crab here, huh? We'll come back and look at this afterwards. What's this? Right there? Yeah. Something. And the crab just jumped off of you. Something really tiny from the ocean. We'll put that in the refugium. One of the crabs jumped off Dad, so maybe I'll grab him. Oh, there he is. We swam really fast to the bottom, so. Uh, Oh, well, that was the white one. Yeah, he jumped off. There's one. Are you going to put all this rock in too? Because it has yeah. like. Now what is this? What's See, there, there's a tiny, there's like green, it looks like a plant on it. Yeah, it's some kind of seaweed, calerpa, whatever. Uh, we'll put us all in the refugium and see what grows. Of course, we'll take out all the bristle worms first. Yeah. Anything that didn't make it as well. I think there was a bristle worm on one of the rocks. No. Yeah, there was a green one. No, I sure did. No, 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 it wasn't that huge one. There was another one. There he is. I just touched him. Ew. Well, that's a different rock than the one I was picking up. Sorry. Yeah, you say you're sorry, but are you really? Yeah, what are you going to really give am. your father? A hug. Yeah, you give him hugs all the time. I want money. Yeah, well, you have to give it to me for it. Did you fart? No. Are you sure? He who smelt it, dealt it. He who did the rhyme, did they crime. I don't believe that. No. You've always been a smelly child. No, I when have you were not. Young. Have no Just a little bit of water. Why so little? Well, because... You missed the bucket. It went on the floor. Half of it hit the bucket. I said I wanted a little. I didn't say I wanted a lot. Why are you so persnickety anyhow? Persnickety, there you go using that word again. Oh, look at the. He's just flipping out. Oh. Oh, well, yeah. He ain't happy. Wouldn't be either. And these are the pipe horses. Now, these are pipe fish or pipe horses? Those are pipe fish. They're called alligator pipe fish. So, alligator pipe fish. We previously had a pipe fish. Well, actually, we had two. We, we sold had, them uh, both. Vietnamese pipe fish that. Uh, and they were red and white. Well, well white cool. with red stripes. Yeah, banded pipe fish. He was really cool looking. I've never seen these ones before. They're a lot fatter, too. The ones that we had, he was really skinny. Well, these ones, uh, they're a lot easier to keep because they're bigger. Okay. So the banded pipe fish, remember, we fed him uh, baby grind. Yeah, he was good eating. Well, I don't mean that we ate him, I meant that. He he was he he ate good. What did you say? Never mind. You said he tasted good. Never mind. You didn't eat him. I did not say that. You're a picky eater, remember? No, I Mommy don't. He won't eat it. You won't eat it. No, I don't remember that. Keith, how is that gonna work? It's just gonna overflow the sides, and then it's gonna leave the box. And your plan is the flawed. The drains over there. Your plan is flawed. No. Yeah. Why not put it so that it's the other way, move everything out from underneath it, then all the water will go into the bottom. Because it ain't staying there for that long. And it's going to go back and forth between the two. Well, see, Dad started these ones a while ago, and they're not even... Well, they're almost full. 
well, I got them in a really slow drip. But so I when this one gets to be full, I'm going to dump the water mostly off, and then I'm going to let it get all mostly full again. And that way, he's uh, acclimating to the water, but I don't want to put all that stinky stuff in my water. Yes. But by leaving them in the bags, they don't stick to the bucket, and therefore I don't have to take them off the bucket. I just put the bag in the tank, and then tomorrow when they come in, they'll be uh, moved off the bag into some place in the tank. Hopefully. Or they'll still be stuck to the bag. Either way, they're easier to sell. Now, where are you going to put the grouper and the puffer? Well, they're going to go down here in this system for now, because I want to make the sure. In the blue tub? No, they're going to go uh, up in one of these tanks. Why not put them in the end tanks? Because they're empty and I cleaned them today. Well, that's in that general direction. Yeah, yeah, They're on the yeah. other side of these tanks. Because all that's in those tanks over there is the big eye, the porcupine, and the baby lionfish that you didn't let me put upstairs. Well, because... Uh, up there. He was so cute. We can be cute upstairs. Yeah, but the other ones are so cute upstairs. Uh, yeah, but there's only six up there. Yeah. How much cute do we need? Well, we're going to have... These are cool. Cute anyway. I'm around. See how they look like an alligator because they got the wide body? But these guys, they're a lot easier to feed. Uh, they'll usually eat right away without any training. They look like leaves. Why do they look like leaves? They don't hide in a tree. No. You know, if I hid in a tree, it'd be... Where good are they found? Not in the ocean, right? Oh, here's our hermit crab. See how tidy he is? I don't know what kind he is, though. Put some water in here. He seems to have small claws, so uh, we'll throw them in the system up top so that uh, we can keep track of them and... Uh, if he gets too big, we'll take him out. Just grabbing up all the rest of them, making sure that there's nothing left on them. Well, and taking the newspaper off and stuff like that, but uh, it's still live rock, and uh, everything in a fish tank, good. Why'd you put him in there? Well, because I'm going to put the mantis shrimp in there, because remember, that's the same water. What's this thing here? Applesauce. You used to say that a long time. You stopped saying that. Yeah. What's that thing that's, like, waving around? That's something that's stuck to the rock, son. Could it possibly be a bristle worm? No, because he's stuck to the rock. Oh, could he possibly be a feather duster then? No. He's more likely to be some kind of seaweed type thing. There's still a big piece right there that you're missing. Jeez. Yeah, but it's just newspaper. The refugium. Everyone says the dad has the best looking refugium. Well, most people don't put that many cool things in the refugium. Yeah, but you have all of our coral in here. Well, that's so I can catch the fish, because pain trying to catch fish with the uh, coral in the way. Especially that one damsel. He used to hide in one of the tubes that you had the coral mounted on. Yeah. So that's why. See, Daddy is just so brilliant. In what world? In my world. Where the sky is purple and there's unicorns and rainbows. And my son is good all the time, does not cause father any grief whatsoever. Oh, well, I live there too. Yeah, but you caused Daddy grief way too much. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Okay. And we'll bicker more after this.